Well, Christine, as soon as the sad news broke, people started arriving here to the Hollywood Walk of Fame. You can see some of the flowers that people have been bringing by and also coming here to take pictures. They've been also sharing their memories of the beloved singer. Everybody wanted to be Sandy. <laughs> Beautiful, bold, and empowered. On and off screen, that's how Olivia Newton-John is being remembered. She almost embodied feminism, but strong feminism, which I always really liked about her. I'm just glad that, that she's um, resting now. In 2019, fan Blanca Morales flew to Florida for a meet and greet with Olivia Newton-John, John Travolta, and other Grease cast members. We wanted her to sing a little snippet of Hopelessly Devoted to You, but sadly, she did mention that like she wasn't singing and because her health was not like very good. You know, she signed her emails. At the end of her email, she would always sign love and light, comma, Olivia or Liv. Barry Pearl played duty in Greece, a member of the Thunderbirds. He was also Olivia's lifelong friend. She didn't meander through life. She penetrated existence. And she was so present and so loving and wonderful. All of her art, her music, came from that place inside of her that was the love and the light. And this I will always go with. Barry says Olivia was a fierce supporter of animal rights and people beating this disease, this cancer. You know, she has her wellness center in, in Australia that she's devoted m many dollars to and, her, and much of her time because she wants to help to er eradicate this disease. Sadly, Olivia lost her battle to cancer. And while her fans are mourning her death, some are choosing to be grateful for the time Olivia spent on this earth. 73 is a fairly good long life, and she left behind a real body of work, a lot of movies, a lot of good music. She was a beautiful person, and uh, she's in a good place now. I have to say, out of her 67 single, singles, Christina Alex, Hopelessly Devoted, is definitely my favorite. How about you guys? Ah, uh, yeah. I, I, and I love You're the One That I Want with John Travolta. It's so great as well. <laughs> Thank you so much, uh, Gina.